3. Grammar Negative questions Is it hot today? This question is not negative. Negative questions is when you say Isn't it hot today? Isn't it hot today? We added not to the auxiliary verb is. Is, isn't. Isn't it hot today? When do we say this and when do we say this? You ask this normal question if you don't know the answer. Is it hot today? You don't know. But look at these two. They know it is hot today. But you ask your friend this if you want him to agree with you. I want you to agree with me. Just say yes. I know it is. I want to share the moment with you. Isn't it hot today? And of course you answer with Yes, it is. Yes, it is. It is hot. It is very hot. I just want to start a conversation with you. The second reason why we use negative questions is if somebody tells you I'm hungry let's eat come on didn't you eat an hour ago didn't you eat an hour ago you can't be hungry one hour ago you ate and now you want to eat again I ask this to show that I'm surprised you can't be hungry it's only been an hour. So again, we add not to the auxiliary verb. The auxiliary verb here is is because this is present progressive. And in here, the auxiliary verb is did because it's in the past. It is an hour ago. One hour ago in the past. If you forgot what present progressive is or past simple, I want you to go to the YouTube search bar and search for Mu'tasim Nadim Past Simple, Present Simple, Present Progressive, if you forgot how to use Past Simple. Okay? Now practice. Read the situations and make negative questions. You're surprised that your brother doesn't know how to use a cash machine. Your brother doesn't know how to use this machine. What do you say to him? Okay, he doesn't know, doesn't. This is present simple. So I will use do or does. Because I'm talking to him, I say you. I don't say does you, I say do you. Make it negative, add not, don't you. Don't you know how to use a cash machine? Don't you know how to use a cash machine? I'm surprised. 2. You see a man who you think went to the same school as you. You two went to the same school you think. What do you say to him? Went in the past, right? It happened in the past. Use did and add not to did. Didn't you go to the same school as me? Didn't we both go to the same school? You can say it this way or that way. You can also say, Didn't we go to the same school? More than one answer is possible. 3. Your best friend buys a new book, but you're quite sure, you're certain, he's read it before. What do you say? Do you see before? We use before with what? With the past? No. With present perfect simple. Do you see he's read it before? His is short for what? He is? No. His is short for he has. He has read it before. This is present perfect simple. We say, haven't you read this book before? Haven't you read this book before? If you forgot what present perfect simple is, again, go to the YouTube search bar and search for Mu'tasim Nadim present perfect simple. You will find a video 
that will teach you present perfect simple. Okay? Good. Now let's move on to the second half of today's grammar. Question tags. Wow. It is beautiful. Isn't it? It is beautiful. Isn't it? Oh, that's very heavy. He can't lift the weight. Can he? He can't lift the weight, can he? Can he and isn't it is what we call question tags. We use them just like negative questions. If we want somebody to agree with us, I know it is beautiful. I just want you to talk to me. I tell you, it is beautiful, isn't it? That means talk to me. Or if I'm not sure, I'm surprised. Look, it's very heavy. He can't lift the weight. Can he? That means I don't know if he can, or maybe I'm surprised that he is trying to lift something that heavy. Now, how do we make these question tags? How do we make them? These are auxiliary verbs. Am, is, are, was, were, have, has, had, can, could, shall, should, will, would, must, and should. First, I want you to find the auxiliary verb. Where is the auxiliary verb here? It is is. Is. Auxiliary verb. Is it affirmative or negative? It is affirmative. Is. To make the question tag, you make it negative. Isn't it? It is. You make it. Isn't it? Look here. Where is the auxiliary verb? He can't lift the weight. It's can't can't. This time the auxiliary verb is negative, right? Look here. We make it affirmative. Can he? He can't lift. Can he? He can't. Can he? He can't. Can he? It is, isn't it? Now look. She finished it. She finished the cake. How do you complete with the question tag? Okay, where is the auxiliary verb? She finished it. No auxiliary verb. What do we do? If you find no auxiliary verb, then I want you to use do, does, or did. We use do and does for present simple. We use does with he, she, and it. Do with I, you, we, and they. We use did with the past simple. Now, which one will we use here? She finished it in the past. We use did. This part is affirmative. We make the question tag, we make it negative. Didn't she? Didn't she? We're not done yet. There is more. I'm afraid there are a few exceptions. Exceptions means they don't follow the rule. The first exception is let's play a game. Any sentence that starts with let's, if you see let's at the beginning, you write shall we. Every time you start with a verb, like eat your food, go to your bed, do your homework, you write will you. Every time you start with I'm or I am. An excellent student. You don't say, am not I? When you say, he is, he is an excellent student, you say, isn't he? You are, aren't you? She is, isn't she? I am, am not I? No, you don't say, am not I? You say, aren't I, okay? I just want you to remember these three. Only three. Let's. If you put a verb first, eat, go to your bed, do your homework, listen to me, and I am, okay? Now, here is practice for you. I want you to write the question tags. Abdelaziz is always late. What will you write here? Okay, first, find the auxiliary verb. It is is. Is is affirmative. You make it negative. Isn't he? Isn't he? Easy, right? 
The teacher will not make a test on Sunday. The auxiliary verb is will. We have will not. It's negative. The teacher will not. You make it affirmative here. Will he? He will not make a test on Sunday. Will he? Give me that pen. Give is a verb. Just like eat your food. Give me the pen. Will you? Let me talk to him. What do you say? Let me talk to him. Do we say shall we? No. This is not let's. They are different. Let's means let us play a game. Is this let us? No. This is let. Let is a verb. Just like eat. Let me talk to him. Will you? Just like this. You miss your father. Okay. Where is the auxiliary verb? I don't see it. Use do, does or did. This is not in the past. It's not in the past. We use do. Don't you. This is affirmative. We make this negative. You miss your father. Don't you. Now practice. Complete the dialogues with the correct question tags. So, went to the bank today. Went. Past. Past simple. No auxiliary verb. Use did. Make it negative. Didn't you? You went to the bank today, didn't you? No, you didn't tell me to go. Okay, you didn't, I see didn't. Make it affirmative, did you? Yes, I did. I told you to go to the bank. Sorry, I didn't hear you. You can go tomorrow. Can, affirmative, make it negative. Can't you? Of course I can, and I will go tomorrow, inshallah. Two, the banks are closed today. We have or, make it negative. Aren't, aren't what? The banks, they. They are the banks, aren't they? Yes, but there is a cash machine round the corner. Round the corner means not far away. Round the corner. You've seen it. You've, you have. You have seen it. This is present perfect. You have. Have is the auxiliary verb. Have. Haven't you? Haven't you? You're right. I'll go there. You won't be long. Won't means will not. You will not be long. Okay, make this affirmative. Will you? No, I just need to check something. You don't have internet banking. Don't, we have don't. Make it do. Do you? No, I don't. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, please share it with friends. I'll see you again next time, inshallah. Goodbye.